Imagine a world where energy is not just a resource, but a powerful lever for economic and geopolitical transformation. A world where a single discovery can shift the balance of power and redefine global alliances. This is not the stuff to science fiction. It's happening right now. China, the world's second largest economy, is making strategic moves that could alter the global energy landscape forever. Two decent developments stand out. China's groundbreaking work on a thorium-based molten salt nuclear reactor and the discovery of the Ling-361 gas field in the South China Sea. These advancements are more than mere technical achievements, they are strategic maneuvers in a rapidly changing multipolar world where economic power dictates global influence. If you are fascinated by how these energy innovations could reshape the global order and want to stay informed on the latest geopolitical shifts, make sure to like this video, share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel for more deep dives into the world of economics and geopolitics. China's ambitious development of a thorium-based molten salt reactor is a potential game changer in nuclear energy. Unlike traditional uranium reactors, which have been plagued by issues ranging from dangerous radioactive waste to the threat of nuclear proliferation, thorium reactors offer a safer, cleaner alternative. Thorium is far more abundant than uranium, generates significantly less long-lived radioactive waste, and is much less suitable for weaponization. For China, energy independence has always been a strategic priority. Thorium reactors could provide a reliable domestic energy source that reduces China's dependence on fossil fuel imports. This would stabilize energy costs, freeing up resources for other strategic investments and shielding the Chinese economy from the volatility of global energy markets. By spearheading thorium reactor technology, China is positioning itself as a global leader in next-generation nuclear energy. This technological edge could translate into economic power through the export of reactor technology and expertise, particularly to developing nations that are looking for cleaner, more sustainable energy solutions. This leadership could also challenge the dominance of traditional nuclear powerhouses like the United States and Russia, shifting the balance of power in the global energy market. In a multipolar world, energy self-sufficiency is a cornerstone of national power. China's success in developing and deploying thorium reactors could diminish the influence of oil and gas-rich countries, particularly in Middle East. As China becomes more self-reliant in energy, its foreign policy could shift, leading to new alliances and a reconfiguration of global power structures. The discovery of the Ling-361 gas field in the South China Sea is another significant step in China's quest for energy security. Estimated to hold over 100 billion cubic meters of natural gas, this field is not just an economic boon, but a strategic asset in a region fraught with geopolitical tensions. China's reliance on imported natural gas has long been a vulnerability. The development of the Ling-361 gas field could drastically reduce this dependence, potentially saving billions in import costs. This would not only enhance China's energy security, but also allow it to redirect financial resources toward other strategic priorities such as technological innovation and military modernization. As China increases its domestic natural gas production, it could reduce its demand for imported LNG, potentially lowering global prices. This shift could have far-reaching consequences for economies that rely heavily on energy exports, particularly those in the Middle East and Russia. The ripple effects of this 
could lead to a realignment of global energy markets with China at the center. The South China Sea is a geopolitical hotspot, with overlapping claims from several countries including Vietnam and Malaysia. The Ling 361 gas fields location within China's exclusive economic zone could heighten tensions, but it also solidifies China's dominance in the region. How China manages this resource and its relations with neighboring countries will be crucial in determining the stability of the region. China's advancements in both nuclear and gas energy are not just about securing resources, they are about securing the future. The developments have the potential to shift the global balance of power, with China emerging as a leader not just in energy but in the global geopolitical arena. What do you think? Will China's energy innovations lead to a new era of global dominance or will they trigger new geopolitical tensions? Share your thoughts in the comments below. I am eager to hear your take on these developments. As we look to the future, one thing is clear. Energy is more than just a commodity. It is the backbone of economic strength and geopolitical influence. China's strides in thorium-based nuclear technology and its strategic discovery of the Ling-361 gas field are setting the stage for a new era in global power dynamics. These innovations could reshape the world's energy markets, alter economic strategies, and redefine geopolitical alliances. As we continue to monitor these developments, it's crucial to understand that the world is entering a new phase of multipolarity where economic power driven by energy innovation will dictate global influence. China's moves today are not just about securing its own future, they are about shaping the future of the world. If you found this analysis insightful, please like this video, subscribe to the channel and ring the notification bell so you don't miss out on our future content. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more deep dives into the forces shaping our world.